guys, so I just got back from Hannaford and I figured I would do a haul of the groceries I got because I have to take them out and put them away anyway. So I might as well do it on video and see if anybody cares. So <clears throat> this wasn't a huge trip, just a quick run there while Phoebe's at school. So um, yeah, I restocked our flavored water. This is what the kids drink all the time. They like this and the raspberry kind. This is the white grape. Um, the big kids drink this, not, not Phoebe. She just drinks plain water. So I got four of those. I got a thing of cola for me. Um, probably like drinking soda is like, it's terrible for you. And it's like, I do it way too much. I don't like drink or smoke or anything else, but I'm bad with soda. And I'm noticing if you buy it in a bottle, it's cheaper than in the cans because, um, Grocery prices are crazy lately. Um, the Hannaford is super close to my house. That's why I go there. Walmart is way cheaper, but it's further away. So it's like, mm. um, I did get a thing of Pepsi for Jeremy because that's what he likes. But like, these are so expensive to get, you know, the name brand in the cans. I'm good with the store brand in the bottle. Um, going on that non-healthy line here. <clears throat> I got some Snapple. Oliver asked me to buy him some iced tea because, like I said, they only all drink flavored water. They don't drink soda. They really sometimes drink milk and juice, but really nothing besides, like, the flavored water. But Oliver has midterms next week, and he wanted something to get him going in the morning, so he asked me to get him iced tea. So I got two of these. Again, cheaper in the big bottle than in the little, like, individual bottles. I don't know why it took me 30-something years to figure that out. <laughs> I mean, I knew that, but I just... The convenience of it whatever i got jelly cranberry sauce um for cassidy this probably isn't good for you either this has been like a terrible haul so far um for some reason she's been wanting to just eat this like jello lately just straight out of the can um i love cranberry i eat it with turkey or pork chops I even eat it with chicken i don't know i've always loved cranberry sauce um i got some pizza rolls some waffles potato skins that I am going to heat up right now because I'm starving. I just got up in the morning and brought Phoebe to school and I haven't eaten anything yet. Um, breakfast strudel. What else we got here? Fruit snacks. So, two boxes of penne. I feel like this is the shape of pasta that we eat the most. So, and these are a dollar box, I think the brand. Um, Cassie Essman get mint Klondike bars. The kids really do eat better than this. I feel like this is all just like a junk food haul. So don't come at me in the comments. But um, I got these sharp cheddar cheese sticks for snacking. I got a bunch of pizza dough. I'm going to put these to rise and make calzones tonight. So, a bunch of those. We got bananas. We got a big old thing of strawberries and like... I was going to get strawberries anyway, but they looked so good. Like, look how huge these strawberries are. Nice and red. Um, it's like hit or miss. They're, they're like really good or normal. They're not usually bad, but sometimes they're like really good. Uh, Ali asked me for Slim Jims. I got sauce for the calzones. These have hidden super veggies. That's a little healthy. Um, another box of penne. Some more fruit snacks. Lucky Charms, um, these waffles, bagels, whole wheat bread, and then this is like a um, impulse buy just last minute Valentine's cakes because it's gonna be Valentine's Day. They really don't eat this horribly. Um, I feel like this was not a good representation of how we eat, but like usually, I mean, I get like the healthy stuff like. This is chickpea plant-based protein pasta. Like we eat a little bit healthy, but anyway. Um, then I just want to show you guys randomly. This is what I'm, not what I'm reading now. Usually like I'll post on Instagram what I'm reading now. And I tried to read this book and I don't know why I thought I had time to read a book, but I don't. So I started reading it. I returned it and then I got it on CD so I could at least listen to it in the car. But this is my favorite author ever. She's so funny. This is The Burnout by Sophie Kinsella. Uh, so at least I can listen to that in the car. 
Um, the other thing I want to share with you guys, another breaking news. Um, hopefully this is true. There's rumors. Hopefully it's true. If you watch my Dollar Tree hauls, you know that I love Dollar Tree, obviously. Um, and my Dollar Tree is like 20 minutes from me. And then the really good Dollar Tree is like half an hour from me. So there's a family dollar that's like a mile from me. It takes like two minutes to get there. Rumor has it that our family dollar is going to be turning into a family dollar slash Dollar Tree. So that's exciting. That's amazing. It has not been confirmed, so I don't want to get too excited, but that would be great because it's like right there. Um, so I could go all the time, which might be bad because then that would be expensive. But if I go over there for like bread, like how I get, usually I get Ollie's bread in um, Dollar Tree, but I wasn't there because it's farther away and it's $1.25 and it's like some of the stuff that I would get normally would be cheaper. So maybe it'll save me money, <laughs> but probably not because I'll be then looking at everything. But then maybe I could do videos in there and stuff and more shop with me's and yeah. So anyway, that's my random haul slash chit chatting. Yeah, that's about it. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know. I don't know. Let me know your, your grocery hacks because groceries are so expensive. Um, like I said, you guys probably know this, but like I said, if you buy things in the bottles instead of like the individual things, it's cheaper. And I saw um, in with the pizza doughs, there was um, pizza crusts. And I usually, a lot of times I'll get like just for like um, busy nights and just quick dinners, I'll get like frozen pizzas. But also like if you just buy the dough and buy the sauce and the cheese, that's gonna be a lot cheaper too. So, oh, and buy the store brand, buy the store brand of things because they're fine. When you put butter on this, it just tastes like butter anyway. <laughs> so, that's my haul. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.